This is a week in my life. I'm keeping this under five minutes, so this is the quickest intro ever. I'm Harry, I'm a third year medical student in New Zealand, and you're gonna see what I got up to this whole week. All right, so let's start with Monday. I woke up, jumped into a nice hot shower, and put my clothes on. I then took my morning medications and supplements, made myself a gorgeous breakfast, and packed my bag. My dad then dropped me off at the bus station. I took the bus to uni, did some studying, did some video editing. I then had two lectures for renal medicine and went back to the library for more studying. We had two more lectures after that and this brings us to 6pm. We then walked to an Italian restaurant and had dinner with some of my friends from second year cadaver dissection class. I went home at 9, did some more editing and jumped in bed. So it's 5.30 in the morning. I have a very long day ahead of me, which is why I rolled out of bed at this time. As usual, I showered and got changed. Today we have ward rounds. I drove to the ferry terminal and caught the 7am ferry. After several hours of morning lectures, me and my colleagues decided to practice the cranial nerve examination on each other. It seems to say that hepatic flap is the same as asteresis. At midday, I grabbed some lunch and gobbled down the food with my friend Jafar here. Then we went and saw some patients at the haematology unit at the hospital. I'm just done seeing patients and we're waiting for the consultants or the attending for the debrief at the end of the day. I returned to the library at 5 to write up the patient's case histories. I then went home, had dinner including some delicious soup, <coughs> watched some YouTube and passed out. Wednesday. Today we have two lectures over Zoom. I woke up and reluctantly opened my laptop and watched them in bed. I then laid in bed for an hour or so, scrolling through social media before finally getting ready for uni. I got up to the library and had a quick meeting about publishing the med school magazine. Then I went down to the kitchen area and ate some food, did some work, i.e. revising lectures and editing, and took the ferry home. I devoured a pre-workout meal, did a grueling upper body workout, got a fat pump, flexed in front of the mirror and hit the hay. See you in the morning. Thursday. This was quite a boring day as I had no classes. I went back into my room and watched a movie. I also practiced a little bit of suturing with the new suturing kit here. I then had lunch and went to work. I work at a medical center and luckily today I'm only working half a day. It wasn't too busy. Anyway, after work, I came home, had some food, revised the lecture on liver function tests in the evening and head to bed. It's Friday today. I woke up at 5.30 a.m. again, did my morning routine, took the public transport to uni and had four morning lectures. After that, I ate my lunch and had a deep conversation with my friend Omar, who is a third year Bachelor of Science student applying for medical school. I had nothing left for today, so I went for a walk at the Domain, got some vitamin D in because why not, it's so nice and sunny. I then spent a few hours trying to figure out how to use Final Cut Pro, which is my latest investment. I left uni at 6. <laughs> On my way home, I went to the pharmacy to pick up my prescription. After dinner, I did a fat workout. At this point, I'm absolutely knackered, so I went to bed at 9. And finally, we got to the weekend. I started Saturday by heading into the CBD for a Muay Thai session. In case you don't know, Muay Thai is a form of boxing with its roots coming from Thailand. I then met up with a friend of mine. We had lunch together and did some studying at uni. On my way home, I bought some wine in preparation for... I'm going to the 21st birthday party tonight. I drove to the venue, had some food, had some fun, and came home at midnight. 